Welcome back. Are we going to have a new MP for the South? More on that shortly. But firstly, accredited visitors. Do you know what they are? Apparently age concern match a visitor with an elderly person in a home who has no one to see them. Well, about four years ago, Sarah started visiting Ruth Tuffrey at Clear House. Now, on the weekend, Sarah was married, but Ruth was too frail to make it along to the wedding. So the wedding came to her. We went along to Clear House to catch the big moment. How are you feeling? All right. I'm not sick at all. Oh, we just love doing things for her. We love getting her dressed up, you know, taking her out. Cause she doesn't get out very often. That's very, how it's very nice to have Sarah here. You know, Sarah takes her out all the time. But how often would Sarah come by? And oh, just about every weekend. Sarah and how long has that been going on? Probably about three years. Yeah. Yeah. No. And does, does it make a difference for Ruth? Does she... Oh, definitely. No, you see the smile on her face when Sarah turns up. Do you remember Sarah? Sarah, yeah. What do you remember about Sarah? She's a nice lady. Four years ago, I matched Sarah with Ruth, and it's one of our best matches. They're absolutely wonderful together. Why do you say that? Why the best match? Uh, there's a caring love there. And they say, Sarah is so young, and to see them together, you'd say that she was her grandparent, you know, there's that love there. It's really good. There was not a lot of words spoken today between the two of them. Doesn't need to. And so Ruth's a lady of very few words, and you've only got to look at her face when Sarah's around. What did you think of Sarah the time you met her? Oh, she's, she looks a nice young girl. <laughs> Of course he is. And he's, he's quite a nice uh, gentleman too. Yeah, the man's going to marry him. What do you think? Uh, do you think Ruth is pretty impressed that they're coming to visit her here today? Oh, yes. It's nice for someone to come and cheer up a bit. She is a nice lady, isn't she, Ruth? She's a lovely yes, lady. Yes, she yeah. is. What did she do for you, oh, Mrs. Tuffrey? She's done a lot for me. Has she taken you out? Yes, she has. I can't get no wheels. You've got no wheels, so she no, takes no, you out? No one else. No, you've got no one else? I no. She'll talk about it for days. The girls will come on in the morning at 7 o'clock and they'll go into Sarah and she'll be telling them all about it and she'll probably tell the same person all week. But it's very special. Here comes Sarah now. Yeah. <laughs> Hello, Ruth. Hello, sweetie. How are you? Uh -huh. You look lovely. Yes. Have you got a new dress on there? What originally got you into it, Sarah? Uh, I just, uh, hmm, I wanted to get to know some older people and who were probably less privileged, who didn't have much family or friends. So um, I arranged it with Audrey Owen, and um, she introduced me to Ruth. So yeah. And what happened the first time you met Ruth? Not much. We didn't know each other, so it was very difficult. Did you know anything about her before you met her? Uh, I just knew that she had one daughter in Australia who was married and didn't correspond with her too much. Yeah, yeah. but that was about all I knew. And when yeah. you first saw her, what was that first impression of her? Oh, she was a sweet old lady. <laughs> yeah, we're going to have to get going now. Yeah. So it's been lovely seeing you. Yeah, nice. Yeah. Yeah. It's a very special day, isn't it? Yeah. Yeah. Well, a person that has a visitor means usually means that they don't have anybody else to visit or not very many people. So it means it keeps them in touch with what's going on in the outside world. And they have a special friend that they can relate to what that special friend's doing. The people are all gone. I'm the last of a big family from Beneden. And uh, to have people like that that are just so loyal and really enjoy coming. It's just wonderful, because it is your visitors in a place like this that gives the place a lift. And here, everyone seems to be so happy. Ruth, thank you very much for letting us join in your special day. Oh, you're welcome to use it. And God bless. God bless you. And we hope next time you catch up with Sarah that she's not mad because we came along too. Yeah, oh, very nice. I wish you all the best. Come back and see us. I will come back and see you. Yeah. Okay. Nice. Thank you so much. Being such a lot of people being killed. And maybe when you're watching the wedding, looking at the wedding photographs, 
Yeah. Maybe we could come back again. Yes, you could too. Would you let us come in again? Yes, I don't wouldn't, wouldn't turn nobody away. You never turn anyone away? No. Could you ask Sarah if that would be all right? So where is Sarah? Do you think she'll let us come back? Yes, she's got much same place to you. Is she really nice, Sarah? Yes, very nice girl. Special, special relationship. I tell you, when Mrs. Tuffrey, she doesn't say a lot, but when she took my hand at the end there, I really, it all made sense about bonding and about not having to use a lot of words. Wonderful to be there at Clear House. Now, Audrey Owen, who's from Accredited Visitors, is currently looking for another four visitors. So if you're interested in that work, you can get hold of her. Her number is 2-4-4-4-4-4-4-4-4-4-4-4-4-4-4-4-4-4-4-4-4-4-4-4-4-4-4-4-4-4-4-4-4-4-4-